Right now it's 6.03 and the manhunt for a suspected killer is entering day four in KCK. Hugo Villanueva Morales is accused of opening fire inside Tequila KC early Sunday morning, killing four men and injuring five others. Last night, police surrounded two homes on two different blocks after getting tips he may be inside. Survivors and victims' families desperately want to see him arrested, but neither of those leads panned out. And the first visitation for a victim in that mass shooting at a KCK bar is scheduled for later today. You heard from one of his friends and the details about the visitation that we told you here at 5 o'clock. Abby Dodge is live in KCK this morning where the shooting happened. Abby, of course, that search continuing this morning. What, what are people saying about this? Joe and Gina, from all of the people we've talked to over these last couple of days, you can tell that they are yearning for some sort of justice for their friends and family that were killed here at Tequila KC Bar. Just in the last couple of hours, another GoFundMe was started for one of the victims in this mass shooting. That GoFundMe is for Martin Rodriguez Gonzalez, and it's already at $1,000 this morning. According to the page, he's from Cuba and doesn't have any family in the States. The page says the money is for his funeral costs. Friends and family of the four victims thought they would get some closure yesterday. Police surrounded two different homes. Someone gave police a tip that the final suspect, still on the loose, could be still in Kansas City, Kansas. They used robots and tactical units to search the homes. One man who was shot at the bar Saturday, or Sunday morning was hoping police would find the suspect. Just to get the joy out of seeing him and get taken in apprehended. I think the police should bring him out in a body bag. I think that'll be justice. Some emotional words from him. Police did not end up finding that suspect in either of the two homes that they searched yesterday. Live in Kansas City, Kansas, Abby Dodge, KCTV 5 News. Okay, Abby, thank you. Be sure to keep us updated if you learn anything new from the scene there.